Now that man sitting down there, I caught him stealing from me like a few years ago. And uh, and I get I felt sorry for him, so I gave him a job, and I gave him quite a bit of work. Well, not I don't know, maybe eight times, paying him money and food, paying him cash and food. And so I've just been out today, and he's and he's there again at my yard because I've been out to drop some stuff off, and he's taking he's stealing again. And so I said, look, come on, we're gonna go to the police and he's like and I said come I said stop and he's, he's riding away on his bicycle so I managed to catch him again so he, he like runs away from me three times so I find him to get him to the get him to come to the police station and I just said look all I want you to do is just get his name and address and tell him never to darken my footstep again and that's all I want because it's and the only thing he's good at is smoking that's it Apart from now, he did uh, he did do a good job on my backyard once, so I was happy with that. But I offered him work like ten days ago. I says, "Come and cut all the mess at the at the warehouse." I offered him work, and he didn't come the next day. I just, <laughs> so now I'm hoping that this is the last time he like he said, because like I said, I don't want him to be charged. I just want him not not to come again. Because I've helped him once, and he's, this is how he repairs it. Never mind. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.